Hi everyone, this is Reese with babyprepping.com and babycaremag.com and today I'm here to talk to you about Bamboo Bees. I don't know if you've seen the other video I did with Carrie Gilmartin, the founder of Bamboo Bees. She was amazing. She's so cool and very genuine and authentic and it was really neat to hear how she came up with um, basically their signature product, which is these, their washable nursing pads, but more importantly how they evolved and how she figured out how to make different styles of them, but also what's really meaningful to her. So aside from the products they make, I just think Bamboo Bees is a really wonderful company because, you know, it's a fellow mom and she just had this struggle that she wanted to fix and she did it and then she shared her solution with other moms like her best friend and then other moms and other moms and it turned into a business. The way I learned about bamboo bees was when I got pregnant and I had a baby and I started nursing I went through three different brands of nursing pads and the first time I put nursing pads on I was like who thought these were a good idea? The fabric sucked and I mean, my nipples were sore already, right? From nursing and learning how to nurse and being a first time mom. And putting these things on, I mean, they were like sandpaper. And I'm sure they were really um, absorbent. It was a little hard for me to tell because I had a, an oversupply, so I just soaked through everything no matter what. But it was really uncomfortable and I thought nobody created these with me in mind. Like whoever created these, never nursed, they've never put anything on their nipples when they were sore, when they've been nursing for, you know, hours and hours at a time. And so I went from brand to brand to brand and each time I was just like, this isn't going to work, it's uncomfortable, they're not absorbent enough, they're super thick and crinkly so you could see them under my shirt really obviously when I was at work and and I just, I got really frustrated. And then I bought the Bamboo Bees brand. They were really highly recommended. I wish I would have bought them sooner and I don't know why I didn't. I just, I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking. I was a new mom. So this is the first product that Carrie came up with and the box is so cute. It has this little hole right here where you can stick your finger in and feel how soft the fabric is. But let me take them out for you so you can see if you're not familiar with them. So this box comes with the ultra thins for light leaking and then the overnights. So I ended up using my overnights mostly again because I had an oversupply, but when I bought a few pairs, I would mostly wear the light ones at work because they're just, they're a lot, um, here you can take a look at both of them. And the light ones are just uh, a little bit thinner. They're a little bit more flexible and they just mold to the body really, really well. So if you take a look at the picture on the back of the box here, and um, and they just they mold to the body really well so I, you couldn't see them under my shirt they were you know they weren't sticking out all funny through you know from the different edges of my bra or depending on what kind of bra I was wearing so they just worked really well I had to change them more often at work but a, a couple of times when I just had a ton of supply but otherwise they're really amazing and they're super soft like I know you can't feel them but you can see the texture there and um, and they're super flexible and these are so cute. They come in a very, very pale pink. And then this is the pale blue. So these are a little bit thicker. Again, just as flexible. These ones I found, depending on the bra I was wearing, um, I'm not like heavily endowed. So, you know, depending on the kind of bra I was wearing, you could kind of see the edges crinkle on the sides through a shirt, you know, outside of the bra or something like that. So, so definitely they were super useful and helpful, especially at night or um, when I, you know, had a lot of heavy, heavy leaking. For example, after a growth spurt and my supply would go up even more because baby was nursing like every hour and a half for 20 hours, um, I would just have tons of milk until it leveled out again. So that's when these came in really, really handy. And these are just great for everyday use. I bought a couple of boxes, somehow kind of get softer as you wash them, which is amazing. And they're made, made out of bamboo rayon, so I love bamboo. So that's the nursing pads. The other thing I wanted to talk to you about today too though was their new organic pumping lubricant. Check that out. And it's so cute because look at this little container. It's actually one of those like lip gloss containers. <laughs> That's adorable. So I wanted to try this out because I haven't pumped, gosh, baby's been off a bottle for, I call her a baby. She's a toddler at this point. She's already two. Um, I'm still nursing. 
and I haven't had to pump in probably 10 months because she just stopped taking a bottle and, and you know, and she started eating solid foods and so she would nurse um, when I was around and when it was more convenient for me and not necessarily every time she was hungry. But recently I had to nurse, uh, I had to pump. It was strange because I hadn't done it in a long time, but also I haven't been sore in a long time and it just, it was really uncomfortable. It was really uncomfortable. Pumping's always kind of uncomfortable, but it was just really not a fun thing to do, especially if you haven't done it in a while. Uh, and so I tried out their lubricant and let me read you the ingredients. It starts with coconut oil. So the first ingredient in here is coconut oil, which I love. I use coconut oil for everything. There's also sunflower seed oil, olive oil, beeswax. I mean, just all really good, basically edible stuff, which makes me feel really good because if I'm putting it on my breasts and on my nipples and it's coming into contact with my milk, clearly even just a tiny trace amounts are going to probably end up in the milk. It's really important to me that it was something that, um, was uh, okay for baby to ingest even in tiny, tiny amounts. Everything's organic, which is fantastic. And it's, I mean, it's kind of hard to see, but it's really thin. It's not a super thick, it's not like lanolin. Like it's really thin and it just comes out, it, it's very oily, I guess. Like it's not like a really thick, thick cream. And it just gets absorbed into the skin really well, but it adds moisture and it adds elasticity and flexibility um, to your skin. So that was super helpful. So um, if you're not aware of this product, I, th I think it's kind of new, but if you're not aware of it and you've had soreness pumping recently or you just started and you're just getting used to it and the other nipple creams aren't working, they're too thick, they're too heavy, which is the experience I had, or maybe just hated them, try this out. I mean, maybe not just for pumping, but you know, in between nursing and then if it's a little too greasy, you can wipe it off you know, right before a nursing session. I don't think you really need to wash it off because it's really light, but it is great for pumping, especially if you experience soreness while you're pumping. And, um, and again, I'm a big fan of the Bambooby's um, company anyway. So, uh, so yeah, so I just wanted to share those two things with you. I will be back in a different video to talk about a couple of their, their other products that I got to try out. One of them, which I absolutely love and I use all the time. So stay tuned for that. And if you haven't seen my interview video with Carrie Gilmartin, go check it out. She's fabulous. She's, um, she's sweet. She's smart. And she's really, really caring. And I think us moms need as much support as possible in the modern world. And knowing that there are companies out there founded by women and fellow moms like Carrie who care very deeply about their customers and who care very deeply about what new moms are going through because she's been there. I think that's really important to know about and um, really important to support, but especially if it works, use it, right? Like parenting's hard enough. Being a new mom is hard enough. So find the stuff that works for you and use it. This is the stuff that works for me. Yay for bamboobies. There's that. Oh, there we go. And um, stay tuned for my next video. Thank you so much for stopping by. Um, see you next time.